Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 12, and this is war number 11, second to last war of the season, and we're going up against an alliance called Agent White. Now, I've scouted out my path, and there was nothing that caused me to change up my regular team. However, Alliance Quest is down. So that meant I could bring in Corvus. Now, this war was winnable. I say was because I think a lot of folks are ready for the season to be over. It was over the weekend. Folks were drinking, drunk. But in any case, we had a lot of deaths early on that could have been avoided. So at this point in time, the war is still winnable. So as you see, path one, Starburst, I bring in Gladiator Hulk. And I'm fighting Dr. Voodoo, who is not difficult to fight. His specials are easy to evade, although there was one war that for some reason, it would not let me evade that special one. See, special one, very easy to evade. But I swiped, it didn't and I got caught by it but that didn't happen here thankfully but I still remember it and so I'm a little cautious now the reason that I'm not firing off a whole lot of specials is because I'm running suicides and I'm used to not throwing a lot of specials but with gladiator hulk I could as long as his face me is active because it's going to heal up most of the damage anyway so it'll just help me uh, finish the fight sooner but old habits die hard. But Dr. Voodoo went down. And as you can see, the uh, little mini boss here is still noted up. So I had to wait, came back like magic. It's cleared. All right, so on to section two. And in section two, I take path two. And at this tier, that's gonna be uh, empowered immunity. Now this time, I was the one late to the party. And they were waiting on me. So I said, all right, let me uh, see what I can do here. And I'm checking out the defense tactics, all right. And uh, looked at Blade, nope, didn't have to worry about that. Now Blade is easy to fight, but he can catch you. He can catch you good, he's caught me before and probably will catch me again. But I decided to go in here with Starkey. Starkey is great because if he does fire the special two, Starkey can evade a lot of it. Now you see how aggressive he was right there? That's why I decided not to build up my poise charges and to push him back. Because he's pushing me too quickly to the left side of the uh, screen and I don't like to be over there. All right, so now I gotta try to bait out that special two. He's almost dead. All right, there we go. See, I was able to evade and avoid uh, some of that damage anyway. And there we go. And down he goes. So, not a hard fight. You just have to be aware. Sometimes you get that really aggressive AI. And you have to be careful not to get yourself trapped in the corner. All right, so next up, we've got Emma Frost. Now, Corvus is perfect for fighting Emma Frost. Not only does he get a mutant mission from this fight, but when he parries Emma Frost, even when she's in diamond form, he applies an armor break, which knocks her right out of diamond form and doesn't allow her to go back in. So he is a perfect counter. Look at that. Armor break. Now she's armor broken. Now it went away. So you have to be careful. She will get diamond form once they all go away. But that's why I'm parrying to keep that up. And she is awakened, so the controls were inverted. But I'm used to that. And you can see here that I'm being very careful because of the defense tactics. I don't want her evading on me and then wrecking me. So... I'm just doing one hit combos until I could get my special two and finish her off. So now I'm like, okay, well, those two fights are done. 
let's see what we got. Now, I am not used to fighting Clairvoyant yet. So I said, all right, I have fought her, you know, in the event quest. So I should be okay. But a couple of things, the best defense, buff A, and the defense tactics. These are things that I had to deal with and I probably would have done better going in here with Gladiator Hulk because he has a heal block on his special one. Instead, I went in with Corvus. Instantly, she got all that power. Why? Corvus had a mission. She nullified. Okay, and just look at this. I'm all in the corner. I'm just like, good grief, girl. Back it up. I don't like being in that corner like that. So I'm still not able to fight my way out of the corner like I would like to because I'm having to be cautious of her evade. And look at that, she's regening back up. All right, I did the special two and you'll notice that it did a little power drain. That's something Corvus's special two does. And again, I'm in the corner. Her special just eats up so much real estate. All right, so now I'm like, all right, I still need to bait this out. All right, got that. And I'm like, all right, if I can just build up to another special two and see that evade. And so I'm like fighting outside of my comfort zone here. She's nullifying, she's getting power, she's healing. And I'm just like, okay, she, now she has more health than she did before. I'm in the corner again. Don't ask me why, I was just getting hit. So I fired off my special two. It didn't do a whole lot. You know, she's gonna keep on healing up. And I got frustrated at this point. I said, you know what? This is just ridiculous. I'm just gonna have to count this up as a learning experience and bring in a different champion, one that can handle all of that regen uh, if I need to encounter her again. Okay, and I don't know why that happened, but like I said, I had, I was already pretty much done. I was going to still fight, but I was pretty much done. All right, so I reported my death and uh, said, I'm just going to sit here and let you guys clear it. So they cleared it, but nobody really wanted to take on this next fight. But by this time, we already knew that it was lost. We made too many mistakes. There were too many deaths. So there was no way we were winning this one. So I went in here. Now Quake on this one is actually a pretty good placement. With that defense uh, tactic, she is really annoying. Okay, so Starkey can do it. I knew Starkey could do it. But again, I'm just trying to get through this fight at this point. We know we're not going to win, so I'm not too worried. I just want to get her down. All right, so I'm trying to build up poise charges. I don't want to hold my block because that's what I often would do to build poise charges. But with her, if you hold your block, she's going to start charging her heavy like that and start putting those stacks on you. Okay. And I can't do full combos. And here she is charging up some more. All right. So look at this. That right there cost me the fight. I don't know why he did not evade. When I saw her firing off her special... I tried to evade and Starkey just stood there and ate it. And of course, with all those stacks, he was going to get stunned. I had no chance to do anything after that. I was still surprised that he didn't move when I told him to move. But whatever. All right, so here we go. And I'm like, oh my goodness. I'm just getting wrecked. But I'm like, you know what? I don't care. I don't care anymore. We just need to get her down. So... I'm throwing caution to the wind. Uh, face me is active here. And so I'm going in, doing some damage. And honestly, at this point, I don't care if I live or die. I know that my teammates will finish her off if I don't finish her off. But I was like, wait a minute. No, 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 no. We are not doing this today. Now see, I'm able to evade that, right? And I was like, no, we are not allowing her to take us down twice. No way. All right, so we're fighting our way back here. Got her down. But that's the last fight.
that I did in this war. Everybody else uh, were able to take out the minis and we got the boss down. We got three full clears. Even though we knew we weren't gonna win, we still need to do full clear so we can get all those points, all right? So I'll be back to show you the results. And we're back, and as a surprise to no one, we lost. But we did manage to get three full clears, so we do have those points at least. So that's gonna do it, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the war. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.